Okay, first of all, it's important to keep in mind that if you double click on the track itself, you're going to get smart controls down below. When you double click on a region, that's where you get the presets and the variations. You can see it shows you a bar ruler up top that'll go by if you only have a single region selected. If you have multiple regions selected, it'll tell you so. So it's very interesting that the variations that we're going to be creating are region-based, not track automation-based, necessarily. What's the easiest way to change up a variation? Well, we can go in and we can split this region in half. Now I use the marquee tool. Uh, just to make it a little easier, we could use the scissor tool. I'm just used to doing things that way. So there we go. Here's a region, and here's a region. So in this region, I'll choose lay it down. In this region, I'll have lay it down, but I'm going to change the complexity. Now I can go even further. And I'll split this region. So we have this region going in here. And you can see automatically that this region is not just going to be a carbon copy of this region. This region's already incorporated a little bit of variation. I can see it visually. Now I'm going to adjust the XY pad here on this region. Now I'll go to this first region. I'll try to make it very close to being exactly the same. But as you see, there's still going to be variations, even though they're very, very similar in where they lay on the XY pad. That's because none of these are ever going to be exactly the same because algorithmically how they're working it out, there are so many variations. We can rest assured that there's not going to be obvious repeats going on. So the XY pad is a fantastic, easy way to switch up variations as we go from region to region. Where we cut the regions is basically giving drummer a sort of linear awareness of where we are in the song. And later on, when we get to an actual arrangement, we'll see how drummer's going to sort of intelligently figure out where it is in the song and play accordingly. 